Now, trying on the Puma Ultras Ultimate straight away. They are very, very comfortable um, speed boot. I can understand why people have transitioned from either speed portal or Mercura Vapors to these. They're cheaper and they feel exactly the same or just as good as the two other speed boots from the other two brands. Um, go for your true to size, your usual size for Puma. So I went with the UK 10s. A little bit of space here at the toe box, which is perfect for me. Very strong midfoot, very tight as well. So it's perfect for uh, narrow to normal feet players. I wouldn't recommend it if you've got wide feet. Go for the Futures if you have wide feet. And the heel cushion here at the back is very, very comfortable. Um, and it feels like you can break into them straight away as soon as you wear the boot, like there's no hard feeling or any uncomfort. Um, the only thing is I would wait until maybe a couple training sessions to use them um, before you take them into a match because again it still has that uh, first few first few sessions of the plastic and for you to break into them fully for the material like the plastics and the other materials to soften up so I would recommend to use them for a new individual or team training for a few sessions first maybe two or three before you take them into a match. I wouldn't wear them straight away into a match. That's my recommendation. But I can see why the likes of Anthony from Manchester United, Carl Walker, why they wear these speed boots, because yeah, they're very, very lightweight as well. Very nimble on the feet. And yeah, it has a very, very good feeling for, for the boot and also for the ball. So yeah, if you are looking for a speed boot for this season or for this current time being, and you don't want to spend, you know, 200 plus, then either go for uh, these Puma Ultras. Um, yeah, sorry, yeah, go for the Puma Ultras. This is a good alternative to the XB Portal Plus and the Mercura Vapor 15s. for watching this unboxing and uh, first try on review if you did make sure to leave the video a like and subscribe and i'll see you another time for another unboxing playtest or shooting video